Hello, St. Paul Public Schools families. I'm so happy to be welcoming you to the 2021-22 school year at St. Paul Public Schools. After the 18 months you have all been through as parents, family members, and members of your community, I hope you were able to spend time with loved ones this summer and do some of the things you hadn't been able to do since before the pandemic began. Many of you, over 14,000 in fact, spent some of the summer learning with us in our summer learning programs, freedom schools, community education courses, and other programs. We hope your students learned something new, made new friends, and most importantly, had fun. Now, we are all getting ready for the first day of school, September 9th for first through 12th grade, and September 13th for pre-kindergarten and kindergarten. Here's what some of our students had to say about coming back to school. Ready to learn about the Hmong people or history around everyone's backstory? Be ready for school. I'm excited to meet new friends, uh, but I am gonna be shy. Next year, I'm excited to meet the new teachers and see everybody again. Learning, reading, writing, having fun with friends, make my mom proud. I am excited for to play new sports uh, like tennis. I'm going to learn all these activities in third grade. And I really like to meet new friends and play a sport, soccer. I'm excited for to make new friends next year. Next year, I'm excited for new friends and a new school. New me too. Bye. Some of our students will choose to learn online this year, and we look forward to providing them with the same high-quality education that our in-person students receive, just in a different way. On that first day, and the days and weeks to follow, our teachers and school staff will be ready to support your child's social, emotional, and physical health along with their learning. Some new things your child may experience include extra support in reading and math, new electives and enrichment classes, more social workers and counselors, and programs and services that are possible thanks to the federal funding from the American Rescue Plan. I also want you to know that your students' health and safety remain our top priority. All staff and students will be required to wear face masks while in our buildings to begin the school year. Other measures from last year will also continue, including daily cleaning and disinfecting, frequent hand washing, contact tracing, and improved ventilation in our schools. If you or your students have not done so already, I encourage you to get vaccinated if you are eligible. The COVID-19 vaccine is the best tool we have to end this pandemic. Please keep yourself and your loved ones safe by getting vaccinated. Thank you for all that you do to support your students and St. Paul Public Schools. We'll see you in September.